Welcome to Olivia's Story Time. Children speak read aloud. Seventeen things I'm not allowed to do anymore, by Jenny Afall, and illustrated by Nancy Carpenter. I had an idea to staple my brother's hair to his pillow. I am not allowed to use stapler anymore. I had an idea to glue my brother's bunny slippers to the floor. I'm not allowed to use the glue anymore. I had an idea to tell my brother he'd soon be eaten by hyenas. I'm not allowed to tell my brother's fortune anymore. I had an idea to walk backward all the way to school. I am not allowed to walk backward to school anymore. I had an idea to do my George Washington report and beavers instead. I'm not allowed to do reports and beavers anymore. I had an idea to dedicate my report to all beavers that ever lived. I'm not allowed to dedicate my report to beavers anymore. I had an idea to tell the class I personally own a hundred beavers. I'm not allowed to say that I own beavers anymore. I had an idea to show Joy Weibo my underpants. I am not allowed to show Joy Weibo my underpants anymore. I had an idea to set Joy Weibo's shoe on fire using the sun and a magnifying glass. I am not allowed to set Joy Weibo on fire anymore. I had an idea to walk backward all the way home from school. I'm not allowed to walk backward home from school anymore. I had an idea to freeze the dead fly in an ice cube tray. I'm not allowed to make ice anymore. I had an idea to wash my hands in the duck's bowl before dinner. I am not allowed to wash my hands in the duck's bowl anymore. I had an idea to give my brother the gift of cauliflower. I'm not allowed to give the gift of cauliflower anymore. I had an idea to order a different dinner for my mother. I'm not allowed to pretend my mother is a waitress anymore. I had an idea to tell the sad story of a mother who fell into a volcano. I'm not allowed to tell sad story about volcanoes anymore. Idea to pretend I've been struck deaf when I heard. Go to your room. I'm not allowed to pretend I've been struck deaf anymore. I had an idea that I might run away to live with the kind and happy beavers. I'm not allowed to talk even a little bit about beavers anymore. I had an idea to say the opposite of what I mean to trick everyone. I'm sorry. I'm allowed to say the opposite of what I mean forever more. We hope you all enjoyed this story. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and share it. Remember to subscribe. Thank you so much.